Up so Huop goes in, we're ready to sprint. First of 10, starter says go, and they're off and racing from that 1,000 meter marker. And I can tell you Casino Ace on the inside came out well enough. Towards the outside is Carp so Huop. Down the center's Rogue Mail. Tam's Knight is no more than a length off the leader. Further back is Captain Cool, got the red cap. Consiglier's got the yellow jacket and five lengths off them. Further back is three coins, the white and red. And then we go back to Black Hole Sun and Rogue Mail after breaking about six lengths off the leader they just went past the 550 and they spread across the track i would say captain cool has just got the lead with consiglier on the inside is casino ace then comes tam's knight who's still two lengths off the leader further back is three coins but now casino ace gets asked to improve and goes in clear of consiglier who's on the outside and running a cracker casino ace got to the front consiglier tam's knight on the inside is three coins but casino ace is is going to win very well. Tam's Knight in second, three coins in third, and fourth might just go to the inside horse that was Rogue Mail. So just keep your eye on fourth. We'll come back to that, but there's no doubt that Casino Ace has come through to open up proceedings. Well done to Mzolis in Jingele, who's been able to pull out a little bit more over here to win a very good race. Tams Knights will run second. That was number two. Third, I thought maybe the gray. Very close. We'll have to leave that as a photo. Consiglier and three coins. We know that this angle can catch you out at the best of times. So one Casino Ace beats number two, Tams Knights. Third, very close. The gray on the inside, prominent. Three coins with number three, Consiglier. Not beaten too far was Rogue Mail. All right, so we'll have a look at this head-on replay. You can see far right-hand side, Casino Ace, the four-year-old son of What a Winter. Well done to Ricky Maingard, of course, to the work rider being Humzolis in Jengele. There was quite a bit of money around, despite drifting late in the day. Anti-post market suggested that there were a few punters that latched on to number one, Casino Ace. Well done to Mr. M.H. Maingard, to Mrs. B. Maingard, and this one bred by the Himalayanada Stud Farm, now one-time winner, from just six starts. We'll wait for the minor positions to be confirmed, but the first race goes to number one, Casino Ace.